Hello there, I'm Rylan and I'm going to show you the overclocks I have for Ethereum mining and Ravencoin mining on my 3080 Ti right here. I got my 3080 Ti right here as you can see and here is the overclock settings I have for it. 110 power, uh, 200 core clock and 1400 memory clock. Now one thing to note from this is that core clock is, in Ravencoin mining is more important to have as high as you can go uh, it, for uh, for the mega hash uh, memory clock, not as much, but it's still I've still found that I can get a little bit, a little bit more out of it if I pump it up a little. But here are the numbers I have. Uh, you can see right here, I'm at 61. Sometimes it'll go to 62 mega hash, and the power is at 370, which is you know, kind of high, but um, but I think it's I think it's worth the um, the the extra power that I had previously. Previously, I was running it at um, at 53, 52 mega hash at um, at 290 watts, and uh, I just recently rearranged uh, my overclocking a little, and it's, I think I think it's worth the uh, worth the extra power. Uh, uh, right here is the uh, temperature, uh, 60 on the core, uh, and 102 on the um, on the memory. And you yeah, see, I can have my. I have, this is an FE, so uh, I have my fan speed set to 100, and it, it does really well. And uh, I think that's uh, a pretty good overclock overall. I haven't had it crash yet, at least. Um, so yeah, um, I'll move on to uh, the numbers I get with Ethereum and the overclock for that. Here are the results I have from uh, my overclocks. On Ethereum for my 3080 Ti, here the overclocks right here, 100 power, uh, zero core clock. Core clock does nothing at all for Ethereum, and then 1300 plus memory. Now, if you uh, if you try to go any higher or much higher than that on all the LHR unlock for uh, NB Miner, it does not uh, work properly. It, it, it or it, it, it locks up the card and continues trying to unlock it. It's just it's just not good to go any higher than that. For at least for the card that I have, uh, your your mileage may vary though. So here you can see I'm getting 88 mega hash, and uh, the power is right about 300 watts, 290, right there. And then then uh, the core temp is 53 degrees, and the memory temp is 98 degrees. That's pretty much it for what I have for you, um, overclocking wise. If you want to know what um, what uh, mega hash a certain algorithm runs, or uh, just any experiments you want me to run with this card, um, just leave them down in the comments, and I'll look at them, and I'll uh, I'll uh, I'll see what I can do about that, and maybe post a video about it. Thanks for watching. Bye.